one simple trick for pronouncing long English words correctly. One of my students was reading an English advertisement for fruit juice. The ad said the juice has no artificial colors or flavors. Artificial was hard to pronounce for my student. Anytime one of my students has trouble pronouncing a longer word, I always break it down into syllables. What's a syllable? A syllable is a unit of sound that a word is divided into, with a vowel sound and usually one or more consonants. If you think of it like music, one syllable is one beat. The word Dave has one beat. Dave. One syllable. The word English has two beats. English. Two syllables. The word syllables has three beats. Syllables. Three syllables. Thinking about pronunciation this way has been very helpful for my students. Dave taught me how to improve my English pronunciation using syllables. How many beats does the word pronunciation have? Five. Pronunciation. Five syllables. Now let's think about the word artificial. How many syllables? The word has four beats. Artificial. If you read a new word that you want to listen to so you can hear the correct pronunciation, I suggest the Oxford Advanced Learner's Dictionary webpage. You can get the meaning of new words and listen to how they sound. I use it often with my private students. There's a link to this site in the description of this video. Try using this simple technique the next time you are having difficulty pronouncing a long English word. Now let's listen again at native speed. This juice contains no artificial colors or flavors. Of course, artificial still has four syllables, four beats, but they are much faster. A great way to improve your English understanding is to improve your own English pronunciation. This will help when you are hearing English at native speed in a movie or on TV. And of course, if you are talking with a native speaker. Learning lists and grammar rules is very popular on the internet. But it's not the best way to improve your communication. You want to learn a language by learning full sentences. This is how we learn to use our own native languages. We pick up words and grammar after we hear them used in conversation. Reading English words is great. Listening to English words is even better. Reading and listening to English words in complete sentences is the best. That's why I make these videos. Try and find study material and tools that teach using lots of natural sentence examples that would be spoken by a native speaker. Tools like my free weekly English newsletter. You can sign up by clicking the icon here. 
Thanks for watching, and remember to like and subscribe. Have an awesome day.